The James Webb Space Telescope is unquestionably one of the most ambitious engineering projects ever attempted. With this much powerful and large telescope, we can expect to learn things far beyond our universe that were previously out of reach of humans. So we're hoping that the James Webb Space Telescope will soon rewrite the history of the cosmos and transform humanity's position in a better place. In today's video, we're going to talk about the James Webb Space Telescope and its latest updates regarding the recent images captured by the telescope, which are to be released on July the 12th. These kinds of images are something that is available to us for the first time in human history. So they will have many surprises for us and they'll certainly shock us as we'll encounter many things up there in space for the first time. So stick around till the end of the video. The James Webb Space Telescope is going to open the doors to a new scientific and research era, an incredibly exciting period of discovery about our universe. The new telescope is so powerful that it's difficult to predict how the first photographs will look, despite years of planning for Webb's first full-color images. The new telescope and the newly acquired high-resolution infrared data will allow us to see things we haven't been able to see before. As recent test images have already shown, Webb's infrared perspective possesses a remarkable level of clarity. However, the images available on July the 14th will be the first to display Webb's complete scientific capabilities in true color. In addition to pictures, the James Webb Telescope can also capture spectroscopic data, which astronomers can read in light. Photos of galaxies, stars and other planets are also included in the first image package that focuses on the science subjects that motivated this mission and will be the emphasis of its work. In fact, the James Webb Telescope has the ability to see distant objects, so it can look at a wide range of things from frozen objects in the Kuiper Belt to potentially habitable moons around gas giant planets in our solar system. According to NASA, tracking a moving target is particularly difficult for the James Webb Telescope. In fact, switching between a cooler and a hotter altitude is one of these issues, and it can throw off the alignment of mirrors and sensors. However, the new information the telescope provides about the far reaches of our solar system will make the effort worthwhile. Planets like Uranus and Neptune have only had a single spacecraft visit somewhat near them, but the James Webb Telescope is able to see inside the atmospheres of many exoplanets and study some of the first galaxies that formed after the cosmos began by using infrared light. The team of scientists working on studying Uranus has set themselves the objective of determining whether or not there is a direct connection between the chemistry and movement of the upper atmosphere, which can be studied with Webb in the coming days. There is already evidence from the test images that the observatory's four instruments are capable of capturing images that are crystal clear and rich in detail. When scientists examined the top two photographs of the Large Magellanic Cloud, a small galaxy that's located in close proximity to the Milky Way, they found that Webb's image exposes details of the interstellar gas that resides between the stars in a way that's never been seen before. To sum up the whole discussion, the James Webb Telescope is so powerful that even the people operating it are uncertain about what to expect. They know the photographs will be stunning, but they're unable to reveal just how stunning they'll be in advance. With a new high-resolution telescope and high-resolution infrared data from this new high-resolution telescope, we can guess how far this telescope can look into the universe, but we'll have to wait and see. A new era in astronomy will dawn thanks to the Webb Telescope's razor-sharp pictures of the cosmos. This new instrument will provide concrete evidence that extraterrestrial life exists if it occurs anywhere in the universe. But what do you think of it? What are your thoughts about life beyond planet Earth? Do you think we'll be able to locate life elsewhere in the near future? Tell us about what you think in the comment section. And if you're interested in watching more amazing stuff, then consider clicking on the videos on the screen right now to watch another amazing video.